Welcome to another walking video. Um, today I'm not in the Peak District um, as the country entered a, uh, another lockdown. Um, so today I'm walking in my local area which is Belper. Um, so Belper's a small market town um, in South Derbyshire um, which is just below the Peak District which is uh, obviously my uh, stomping ground for my walks but um yeah i mean i could visit the peak district still and do some walks it'd be safe for me to do so but i just thought you know what, i'm not going to take any risks and uh i'm gonna get go out and explore my local area so uh that's the plan and um, so i'm hopefully going to do a bit of a mini series on my channel of uh walking in my local area and exploring my local area and hopefully it'll encourage more people to uh, do the same thing because I think entering another lockdown, you know, it's, it's not good for, you know, your mental health because, well, especially this one because we, we are, you know, it's a stay at home lockdown other than going out to work and exercise and, you know, this is classed as exercise obviously, going for a walk. So, um, yeah, I think it's just so important for everyone to still, you know, try and get out and have your daily exercise and get out in nature um, I think that's the only way we're going to get through this um, so yeah today I've uh, started at the, the North Mill in Belper um, which is situated on the uh, Derwent Valley Heritage Way which is a um, it's a 50 mile route or you know it's a walking route um, which starts in Lady Bower, or by Lady Bower Reservoir, and it goes all the way down through the Peak District, through Belper, and down towards Derby. Um, and along the way, it's uh, it's got lo lots of mills. Uh, it's just a very historical walking route uh, today. And uh, yeah, so you get to walk past all the mills. Um, yeah, it's a beautiful walk, and hopefully, I'm, I'm well, this summer, I'm hoping to. Uh, try and do the heritage way as a uh, kind of like a two-part video because I kind of live at the halfway point so I could start at Lady Bower walk down to uh, Belper and then sleep the night and do the rest of the route the next day so that's a plan for the summer but anyway yeah so I've started at uh, the Belper North Mill um, and I'm walking along the River Derwent now which is just behind that tree line over there um, and I'm walking towards Milford which is another little uh, mill town or mill village um, situated on the uh, Heritage Way um, and once I've got to Milford I'll be walking up the hill towards Chevin Golf Course back along the ridge and back down towards Belper so it's just a short walk uh, um, and one I haven't done before um, and I know there's supposed to be quite a lot of uh, nice spots along the way we've got a, a train tunnel which apparently was the longest train tunnel in Great Britain when it was built in the 1800s so I'll show you that along the way and I'll show you Milford and obviously I'll just keep checking in when I see something cool so uh, I hope you enjoy the walk and I hope you enjoy the video and hopefully it encourages you to get out as well. Um, so yeah, I'll catch up with you soon.
So we're just heading into Milford now. And uh, we just passed the train tunnel. And there's a load of workers there, so <laughs> I didn't stop there to have a chat. But yeah, the tunnel is uh, its quite impressive, really. It was built in uh, 1838. And it only took two years to build. And it, uh, it's 800 metres long, just under. Which, back then, considering they built that in two years, I just think that's amazing. <laughs> um, so yeah, we passed that now. And uh, we just missed the train going through, which was a bit annoyed. <laughs> Because that would have made a nice little shot, but oh well. Um, but we're heading into Milford now. And uh, there's a nice little mill here, which I'm pretty sure part of it is now the primary school. Which is uh, pretty cool. Um, and then we're going to head up towards Trevon Golf Course. And I'll uh, probably catch up with you when I'm at the top of the hill along the ridge. So I'll see you there. So we've made it to uh, the top of the ridge now, just above Belper, um, and you get a beautiful view up here of uh, the whole of Belper and part of Milford. Gorgeous view, and you can see the mill where we started the walk, just down there. I'll zoom in a bit for you, and that's where we're heading now. Uh, I'm so glad I came up here because I always go to the Peak District. <laughs> I think that's uh, the problem with having the Peak District on your doorstep. I just always go there because it's, you know, it's amazing. But um, this has reminded me that, you know, I still live in an amazing area, in a beautiful area. Um, and I would have never really come up here usually, um, to be honest. Um, and I'm so glad I did. Got a stunning view of Belper and I've seen uh, lots of other routes and footpaths which um, I'm definitely going to have a look on a map later and see where they get lead to. Um, and I'll definitely be making a few more videos of uh, exploring my local area. But anyway, we're heading on along the ridge now and we're gonna, I'm going to drop back down towards Belper now. And I'll uh, catch up with you probably back at the mill. So I've just made it back down to the mill in Belper, uh, which marks the end of the walk. Um, it was a really nice walk. It was nice to explore an area I've never really done before, especially with it being in my local area. Um, so I'm definitely gonna do more of these walks and uh, hopefully post them on the tube. Um, so yeah, I hope uh, you all managed to get out during this lockdown and uh, you know, it's, uh, I think it's really important, especially with it being the third lockdown and I know we're all fed up of it. Um, so I hope you manage to get out in your local area and uh, get out in the countryside if you can. I mean, wherever you are, just getting outside is going to do you some good. 
uh, I can tell you that for a fact. So yeah, thank you for watching the video again. Um, if you really liked it, give it a little thumbs up for me. And if you uh, feel like it, why not subscribe to the channel? It'll really help me out. But anyway, thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you in the next lockdown walk. Cheers.